Hi guys, in today's video, we're going to start off with, well, it didn't show it here, but there was an event, there's an event going on, sorry, for Magneto, and he's a legendary. If I go to my Magneto, for example, just so you can see, and bear in mind, my Magneto is pretty strong, max level, maxed out on abilities, tier 15, uh, maxed out on striker, okay, and he's five red stars out of the possible seven. So yeah, he's a really strong one, 155,000 power. Now with this character, um, he's available in the event at the moment. I can't show you guys, unfortunately, because he's a legendary. Once you've got a legendary that's unlocked fully at level 7, what happens is, the next time the event comes on again, um, you get character shards in place of it. So you kind of get like freebies, for example. And to unlock Magneto, you do need um, X-Men characters and Brotherhood, but you need five in total. So that's how you get him. So unfortunately, I can't show you guys, but to go ahead with the video, um, we're just going to carry on with what we've got on screen, starting off with the daily objectives. We got uh, the daily objectives finished as I press these ticks. Just so you guys know, there's an hour and 50 odd minutes. Uh, remaining for the strike pass at the moment of this recording and I've already completed it yesterday now there's a war going on there's a few things going on here real-time arena let's just start with this for some uh, for example you go to objectives now you can see here there's a weekly event and then there's a daily one I've done all my dailies one that's pretty high for three days remaining and we're on level 20 which is pretty decent I've also just claimed the daily objectives for real-time arena and the other way to get it is through the blitz by literally going through blitz and then just literally tap and hopefully get some points this one's a lose obviously i'll press that way too quick but obviously by just beating these you can see here and just a handful more this is just an example let's see if we win all right so this will give me plus three points if i got to my um real-time arena press go these points go up um, accordingly so that's how that works coming soon chaos theory just make sure that you got your wakandans ready for that and again just to reiterate i think i mentioned this on a previous video you do get 20 silver promotion credits and seven gold star um credits right so they're going to be useful for your supplies and then you go to the um the silver elite sorry the elite store and then you can see further down which characters you can purchase with those currencies and then don't forget for the very first one you'll have uh, dark promotion credits that will be used for either Ultimus, Ultron or Doctor Doom depending on where you are at and if there's anyone who's watching like Fate's Fury for example which I doubt um, the top level characters um, it's obviously going to have Dormammu um, there because it's all the dark dimension characters and the clues in the name you press that it says dark promotion credits so it says dark and if you go to the uh, dark dimension dark you can see here on the screen that every thing to do with the characters ultron uh, ultimus uh, doctor doom then obviously finally for uh, the last one dormammu they will be on there and when i said those characters anyone with the red uh oh you're getting some more now there's six people who's completed in the world which is crazy so yeah that's how it works for the elite stores okay and for now, what we're going to do is we're going to go to uh, my roster. We're going to go up towards Adam Warlock. Unfortunately, I cannot level him up um, fully to this tier because I do require this item and it's not available in store. And it's one of those things, whenever you want it, I think the game purposefully knows you're in need of it. So they try to make you wait as long as possible until you kind of like fold and say, oh, forget it, I'm just going to buy it kind of thing. I noticed that because I had loads of these available and I just didn't want to take advantage of it because it was only for Ghost Rider, which I wasn't willing to take forward, as you can see there, Ghost Rider. And I thought I had enough anyway. Plus, there was no one else for it, so it's all good. But anyway, what we can do for Adam Warlock is we can maximize these. So it's not that I, this character is the best or anything. I just want to just do it because I just do and he's going to be maxed out on all the abilities as you can see on the screen there we go now to add to this 
if I do 80, that's probably going to go way too high. So if I've got milestones, I'm already on a million. So we're going to go to milestone 15. So that's 1.2 million roughly. If we go back to the roster. Adam Warlock, 1.3. So 78 is pretty decent for that. Okay, and then we can just equip these. Just make them a tiny bit stronger. Yep, and then if we go to the milestones. I'm sure, it should be 15. That's it, perfect. And it says it on the, on the top left before I even claim it. So there you go, that's Adam Warlock beefed up. Go to the offers, let's see what is available. I normally go for the power core type of things. Sometimes it's a hidden gem. Uh, and unfortunately, nothing for today. Okay, going to the orbs, premium orb. Let's open up all five. Yeah, pretty decent. I'm very happy with the anti venom ones. Uh, Death pool, pretty good. Uh, the rest, just whatever. Right. Um, yep, yeah, we've got six additional red star orbs um, from yesterday. Uh, what happens is in the daily login, if you go to the home page, you go to inbox, bottom left it says daily rewards. If I go down to ISO 8, it's on day 7, so you get 10,000 red star orbs, which will be 5. So that's pretty handy. Let's claim that. Go to orbs. Let's just start opening up red stars. I'm going to go down to 20. Hopefully I can get Scarlet Spider. Let's go. Okay, I've already got that. Let's go more. Okay, that's an upgrade, but it's not that good. I want minimum five stars. Okay, Thor. And let's keep going. Not so good. Okay, not good again. And then finally, how have we got Blob? Mr. Blobby. Okay, that's rubbish. Really rubbish. Okay, let's see who we got further down. Okay. Oh, sorry, what have we got further down? Gold. Mm. Bit of a rainbow colour going on there. 265,000. Not that good. Okay. Yep. Milestone 2 orbs. Let's open up all 6. Yeah, normal. I've got stature, which I do need, so there you go. That's not too bad. Okay, next to the blitz. Okay, I'll open up these ones in my own time. But purple bio is the one I recommend because of the spider web warriors coming up or web warriors, whatever it is. Oh, 10 misty night shards, very nice. Okay, claim those. Go to the raid. Yeah, I'm doing pretty good on Sharon Carter shards, and hopefully, I can get enough in time for the Omega Red event. But I've still got a lot to do for um, Nick Fury, so that's going to take a little while. Okay, ignore those, they're not good enough for video. Okay, and then I'm just going to claim these. As you can see, I'm maxing out on all the, the weak lots of the characters. That's three in a go. Okay. I can be going for Shatter, sorry, long shot. That's Shatter Stars Twin. Um, but I'm just not interested in the character. And that could actually help Adam Warlock. So kind of just going against my myself. But I do need to save the War Store credits, which are these ones. They are not easy to come by. Anyway, uh, we'll do this one first. Get some T2, sorry, T1 ISOs. Oh, yeah. And then finally, we go to the Elite. And let's just do a four star orb. Let's do that. So there's a four minimum guaranteed plus up. Actually, sorry. There's an increased drop rate for these guys, the ones that are shown on there. Usually, that's what it means. Okay, let's open that. I oh, don't really want that. Okay, whatever. Good news is I've got a five star because I've got enough of that, I think. All right. Uh, whatever. She wants to get promoted. Boring. Okay. Whew. Anyway, have we got enough? <gasps> Let's see what we get. Pray for me, guys. Pray for me. Three, two, one. Boom. <gasps> whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, for God's sake, is that good? I'm not sure. It's good, but it's is it? 
Is it good, guys? Let me know in the comments below. Okay. Juggernaut. Six red stars. Even if he was seven red stars. I don't know. Don't know even how I'd react to that still. Hmm. Yeah. It's... It's alright. Oh, hang on. Have I got 10 million points? <gasps> Sorry, guys. I'm a little bit excited. I've got 10 million total collection power. Sorry for the over-the-top exaggerations. But yeah, now I'm a 10 million thousand TCP total collection power. TCP. Yeah, that's... Yeah, pushed me up. Uh, oh, yeah. Collection power. I don't know if that's the Alliance one, is it? No, it's not. Yep, so I'm in the top 100,000. 104,000. It's kind of weird because um, I'm quite high up in the... Uh, strongest teams but in collection power. I'm not really that high up in my opinion. I'm just in the top 10% or 1% whatever it is. I don't know. I'm sure it's the top 10% but I don't really focus on all the weaker members hence why there's probably a bit of a lack on that and bear in mind my total no sorry my strongest team power normally is one tenth of my entire roster but since there's quite a lot of good characters recently I've actually been spreading my um roster around which is gonna help um so yeah again you how how far can i get my characters my top characters when unfortunately the resources aren't exactly uh quite easy to ascertain or to collect whatever um as you can see i'm exactly getting the green plus signs everywhere for my top character that's just an example I, again one of my favorite characters in the game and in the mcu so yeah, that's Captain Marvel, that is. Okay, so we've done that. For Alliance Raids, let's just show you where we are. Now, we've got a Doom 1 going on currently. I am currently second in my Alliance. Shout out to Raiden for achieving his Dark Dimension 4 win. And yeah, that's great, great news. Well, obviously for the rest of the Alliance, well done for all your efforts. And yeah, so I'm currently second. Now, Carnage 87 smashing it is doing amazing. For myself, I'm second. Now, if I press continue, I'm kind of at a bit of a standstill. I messed up my last attack because I pressed four by accident, four characters, and they weren't exactly strong. And it requires mutants. If I press launch, I'm able to do so. Unfortunately, without healing, I've got to use quite a lot of heals just for a team to actually work. Even if it was for my strongest team, I've got a handful of damage to go through still. I'm roughly the halfway mark, and then unfortunately I've got the boss one, which is the one with the face. So I can't really do that, and it's a lot stronger, and it requires mutants. My mutants seems that I need to work on them, really. That's just where it is. So unfortunately, that's where I think I'm stuck. Okay, now let's get on with the Blitz, the Avengers Tower. Okay, so we're going to start off with the opponent here, which is a mini boss, floor 35. Okay, so what we are going to do is have a look roughly at the next few teams. I'm going to go up to the next four or five teams. Okay, so this team, not so dangerous, but again, Emma Frost and Sinister are the best ones. The next one's not really all that, except for Moon Dragon, potentially Ultimus, because you can do big damage. The floor after that's fairly easy. The floor after that, really easy. The floor after that is Silver Surfer and Baron Zemo who are the issues. Uh, that's a good team actually. It's a Hydra uh, Zemo kind of team and Silver Surfer. Right, so we are going to do the attack based on the team that I'm going to select. So just looking at the team, 107 is the top, these two. They got the blues, so they'll be stronger. And I don't mean the blues as, as in they're sad. I mean the blues as in the blue isos. Okay. Next we will go with... Let's think. I might probably go for the black order for this one. Mm. 724. I had an issue yesterday. Black order against the tower black order. And I lost... I'm just thinking, is this the right team? Possibly would be because of uh, the 
damage is in the effects. So I'm just going to go for my black order. That's all I can do. There are other alternatives, do not get me wrong, but I'm just trying to ensure that I do level up. And again, it's all down to the fight. Let's see how we get it on. Okay, we got Red Guardian with the taunt straight away. Okay, Red Guardian again. Now I'm going to probably, oh, I'm not going to use this one yet, time shift. I'm going to stick to Red Guardian. Right, get as much damage on him. Okay, Proxima Midnight very low in health already, not good. Okay, now I'm slowed, not good again. Right, no negatives on the opposition. Yeah, it's going to be a bit of a challenge now, because Ebony Moor is literally the best one to clone, just so you know, guys. Right, so we're going to... Okay, we can't do anyone else. Have to do that. Yes, that's good for me. Okay. <clears throat> Sorry, guys. Okay. Yeah, now I can do this because Emma Frost would have cleared all those. So now we're going to focus on... Okay, just remember you can see the the ISO. So it says Skirmisher. So if it was a Red Guardian, who I'm going to attack now, it wouldn't do Striker's attack because it's vulnerable. That's called a Sclave. So I'm just going to have to wait the turn. Heal the team. Perfect. Okay, go on to that one. Mystique's out. Do the big attack. The way he's doing it now indicates that there's going to be some characters surviving. Definitely go for Strife. Yes, now all out Emma Frost. Sometimes it looks like the the attacks are overpowered, but sometimes that is the difference. When you're just about fighting and winning, not a good sign. Not a good sign at all. Okay. When it's a clear win like that, you feel like you've overpowered, but then you kind of wish that I kind of should have overpowered. That's one down. Okay, next one is floor 36. Now, Phylobel, Moon Dragon issues. Korath, we can ignore. Uh, Ultimus is there. Obviously, I love Cap Captain Marvel, but she's not going to be damaging. So, what we will do is a 435. 90 is the strongest. 90,000. Get rid of these guys. We will have uh, Phoenix. Magneto. Uh, Minerva, just in case. I, I can change this team, obviously. I will do... Okay. Okay, at least I've got Adam Warlock. That's good. Okay, the good thing is in this team that we got Phoenix and Adam Warlock. They both do that revive thing. And I think we'll be safe to add Gamora. Oh, yeah. Okay, so we got... Um, yeah, I think that should be good. So my weakest is my Gamora, which is around their strongest. And everyone else is way stronger. Uh, the only issue is my, my Minerva is not that strong. Uh, as in, like, just defense-wise. She's a great character, but... Let's just go with it, because they've got Korath and we can take it on with that. Again, like I said, it's better to have a team that you know would win, as opposed to a team that might just win. Because we're at the higher parts of the tower, not the strongest part, but hopefully you get the idea now. Okay. Okay, I should have done an attack on uh, Ultimus, but whatever, I've done it now. Ultimus attacks. Okay. Align the team. Yeah. Gamora is pissed. All right. Big wide attack. Done. Boom. Yeah. Okay. I'm not too familiar with... Um, Adam Warlock, so whatever the sound effects I make during the fights, just go with it. Um, File of Vel, Moon Dragon, just do the negatives on her. Do the big attack on him, way overpowered, but just feeling it. We will do File of Vel. Do the big heal one. Nice, very nice. Okay, he's a striker, so we've got a second attack. Just gonna get all on File of Vel. 
She looks like that Disney character, Ursula, I think. The one in the mermaid one, the... That evil woman one, that fish thing. I don't know what it's called. I'm sure it's called Ursula, but just a lot skinnier. It's probably her from the younger days. Who knows? Let me know in the comments below. Yep. Just keep going straight. And <laughs> just going to keep attacking here. Okay, we've got a lot of bleeds on... On her, I'm sure she will not survive that. Just out of interest, turn of bleed. <laughs> Couldn't even make it. Magneto just wanted to just destroy her. Okay, now we're going to go for Moon Dragon. Boom. One more attack. Boom. And full on attacks. Captain Marvel. Bye bye. Yep, not a struggle. And Adam Warlock seems pretty decent. So that's three legendaries on the team. Phoenix, Magneto, and Adam Warlock. Okay, next team. Yeah, not a struggle, I reckon. I should be okay with this. Um, what I'm going to do for this one then is have Emma Frost, Baron Zemo, um, Ultron, because I just need it, because it's starting to become weak as a team otherwise. Maybe Wolverine. And I think... Okay. No, these guys are fine. Maybe Ronin. Yep, yeah, maybe Ronin. Okay, just double check it. My power's way stronger. My weakest is 90. Their strongest is 85 that's two of them colossus is going to be the issue and phoenix mm, i think that's a good team actually to go against because i've got ultron that's fine ultron's gonna be the biggest game changer for me on this level um ronin can get rid of the positive effects um okay and then we're gonna go for black widow get ability block hopefully destroy her Maybe not, but at least she's got ability block. She can't speed the team up. Let's go Yelena Blova. If I go here, there's a chance uh, Wolverine can go out this way. Whereas if I go here uh, to Yelena Blova, it's one, two. And then definitely going back to Black Widow. So one, two, there you go, straight. So that's why you're going to position your attacks the right way. We're going to, yep, spawn some bots. There we go. We're going to, yep, just go straight for the attacks. Just straight for the attacks now. Colossus is going to try to uh, taunt while she comes back as Dark Phoenix, quite possibly, or towards the end. But we will have to get rid of her, actually, because she's got big damages, and she's very hard to get rid of. But at least now Emma Frost can get rid of this taunt. Maybe not. He's got great resistance, so unfortunately, can't do much. Okay, just going to keep having to attack, unfortunately, on Colossus. And we're just going to keep going forward. Um, yeah, can only do the big attacks now. And Dark Phoenix is probably going to do that big attack, and I'm probably going to struggle a little bit. Yeah, okay, still surviving. That's good. Uh, unfortunately, now it's not exactly the best situation. But we can do the big smash. Ability block, that's good. Unfortunately, I'm running really low on health. I've got Emma Frost and Ultron who can revive. And we're just going to keep healing the team when we can. Yes, big attack. Let's do it. Straight. Okay, now this is where we're going to get Yelena. Yelena Belova. Nice. And again. And again. We're going to go, okay, we're going to have to go for him because he's the one who wants to taunt. Let's bring it on, then closest. Closest. Yep. Keep going. That's it. We're getting there. It's just, it's starting to get to those levels where it's kind of like as if you're just scraping the surface, kind of like thinking, oh, I'm just about beating it. So, yeah. Just summon more just in case. You never know. Close to the end, don't want to ruin it with this silly mistake. And then big one, boom. And then one, two, 
Done. Nice. Sorted. That's two down. Two for two. Yeah. Okay, this team, very easy uh, because they're just Krees. And there are good Krees. For example, Captain Marvel, my strongest. Uh, Ronan and the Accuser, my third strongest. And Minerva, one of my strongest. Definitely in the top 10, 15. Right there. Okay, so for this team, we will go... Um, let's just put in the weaker ones just to see if we can take these guys on. Hmm. I think this might be a bit too weak. They're not exactly power strong. They're just like strong. Nebula is an issue. Kree Noble keep clearing up negatives. Um, I will try it just because I know it's a bit of an issue if I do use a stronger team. Because if I use a stronger team, then I definitely can't use this team now. Okay, so we're going to go straight on to Korath because he can speed the team up. Though um, Ghost is very weak in defense, she does make up for it in a, an attack. So I have to survive long enough. Hopefully I can. Come on, punish her. Stay in the game. Okay, just do that big one there. Heal. Okay, heal block. Yep. That's fine. We're going to go for that Kree Noble, the one I've just selected. Okay, let's just see if we can survive. Keep going. Come on, come on. Stay strong, guys. Okay, let's see what we can get. Hmm. Even though with Black Panther, I can get rid of these guys and do one turn attacks. I'd rather just do the, you know, focus on the reduction of the opposition. So we're going to go for the weaker nebula. Get countered and attack. That's fine. Attack. Unfortunately, she's revived. Come on, Black Panther. That's fine. Four on one. But she's got the highest health. Hopefully I can fix that. No, come on. I don't even have a heal. That's just silly. Okay, this one does 180 plus 10. And this one does 200. Obviously, do the first one. Okay, she survived. And now she's revived. I should be able to win this now. There you go. So yeah, that wasn't exactly the best team, but it was still worth me investing in that. Like I said, it wasn't exactly a strong opposition. So yeah, that's floor 39. And there now... Oh, sorry. We are now on floor 39. This one, what I'm looking at now... Okay. So we've got a Symbiotes team ready still. We've got a very strong team to add on top. And I probably will actually go for my Doctor Doom's team. So, Doctor Doom. I'm not going to use the top three here. Doctor Doom. Um, one second. We've got one, two, three. Top three guys there. Four, five, Hella and Doctor Octopus. Okay, that's the next team. This team will be... Loki added. We're going to use Kestrel 100%. Um, we're going to have to have Silver Surfer, no problem. And Doctor Strange. That's fine. Let's see what we got. Yeah, I'll be fairly confident with that team. Yeah. Unfortunately, Doctor Strange is just weak. Um, even though I've got him seven red stars, he just doesn't survive as, strong, um, as much as he can. And again, I've said this in a video a long time ago. Yeah, Doctor Strange, no, there you go. It's just already weakened. That's not fair. Oh, what the hell is that? Okay, anyway. Um, oh, okay. We're just going to go for Silver Surfer because he's very good. Um, yeah, Doctor Strange. They should do a time loop where he actually just comes back in. That'll be really good. As in, he can get attacked in about two, three turns later, he comes in. Okay, this is not great. Okay, we're going to go straight with um, Silver Surfer. Got a striker on him. So he's going to do another attack. That's very good. Very good. Okay, we're going to go for um, Disrupt on Crossbones. So he can't do his thing. Winter Soldier. There we go. I'm going to focus on Red Skull. Yeah, we've got the Disrupt on him. Oh, that's good. A bit of a good catch-up there. Seems kind of like a bit of a strange one, but there you are. No pun intended with Doctor Strange, but there you are. Boom. So yeah, we've only got two more good teams worthy of staying in the fights.
Let's see what we can do. Okay, now we're going on to floor 40. Now, this is a stronger team. And we've got that team, and then we've got the next team there, as in floor 41. Then I can only stop at that for today's. Um, so if I just get rid of this one. Oh, shit. I mean, I'm sorry, guys. Um, you didn't hear that. Okay. Um, I said shoot. Okay, so floor 41, slightly weaker because Ghost is not strong. Emma Frost makes up for it. And Captain America Sam. I'm just thinking... Hmm. I don't know if the symbiotes can take them on as easily. Probably going to have to go for this team. Hella and Doc Ock. Okay, I think I'm going to have to go for that team. It's one of my stronger teams. Um, yeah, that's just, I'm just going to have to go for it. I can't just speculate. You can't just speculate, you got to participate. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Probably going to name that the title of this video. Okay. Or oh, spectate. Okay. Uh, not speculate. Okay. Beast. That's the first. Oh, God. Was it aiming for beast? Come on. Beast eight. Okay. Whatever. Big attack. Not big enough. Okay. Oh, I'm not a fan of this team because what happens is. Um, Okay, sorry, this part I have to be careful. Do the disrupt on Beast. Now when Phoenix does her clone thing, whatever it's called. Uh, let's just get Phoenix. You can't really tell who's being selected. It says Phoenix there, so I'm going to clone Phoenix. Yeah, one Cyclops uh, gets upset when Phoenix is down. Oh, God. I'm trying to aim for Beast. It's kind of tricky with this. Okay, Beast it is. Making sure. Claim all the negatives. There you go. What happens is Cyclops gets a bit too upset and then he does his big Cyclops attack blast thing. And then it's literally almost game over kind of thing. This one, slow the team down. Come on. Come on, Beast. Oh, he's uh, just about surviving. That's not good for me. Yes, come on, Beast. Get it out. There you go. I'm trying to get Cyclops before he gets the rest of the team because that damage is really strong. I'm going to lose Doc Ock any second. Um, unfortunately, I can't get all the characters, but I'd rather use this big attack before I get attacked big. There we go. Got rid of Cyclops. Perfect. Very nice. Okay. Just do the same simple basic attacks. Okay. Heal the team. Definitely need that. Just in case. You never know. Yeah, never know. Okay. Unfortunately, I can't get to Phoenix before she gets to my team. Oh, 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 oh. Hang on. Who knows? Boom. Yeah, and that's that's a perfect. That's that's a great win. Yeah, big attack. Let's do it. Okay, there's no way he's gonna survive now. Perfect, perfect. Okay, that's perfect. Okay, so now <clears throat> floor forty now achieved. Now it's all about the next one. Okay, oh, we're gonna claim this now. Milestone eight. Perfect. We've only got two days and an hour remaining. I can almost get the master on tennis, assuming I can complete these. Okay, this one, the last team I can only use for the day, and that's going to have to be the symbiotes. I've got no other teams for this. So symbiotes, if they do it, amazing. I don't see how they'd struggle. But let's see what we got. It's one of my favorite teams as well. They're all tier 15. They're all maxed out on abilities. They're all levels 85. They're, they're a great team. Okay, now I'm going to go for Falcon. If I can destroy him in time. Okay, why have they got so many attacks on me already? That's not making any sense. Whatever. Okay, we're gonna go for Emma Frost. Do it this way, then that's it. Okay, Falcon. I'm just gonna get rid of him just in case. Okay, perfect. I'm gonna do ability block on him. Hopefully it works. Nope. I oh, don't know I did. Oh, <laughs> Didn't last long. Okay. That's perfect again. Gonna go in the middle, attack all three. That's two down. Go on to Captain Sam. Captain America Sam. I'm just gonna keep getting all the attacks on him. Hopefully Connage is the next one and he's got a lot of negatives. I can do that big attack. Who knows? 
Okay, I'm just going to spread it out actually. Perfect. I'm going to go to Ghost actually and then just change it there. Oh, I'm going to leave Captain America Sam, go for Emma Frost, do the big attack. Done, we're going to win. It's just going to be simple attacks now. Yep. That's another one. And then another one. And another one. And another one. There we go. Done. That's four or five attacks back to back and all wins. Perfect. Yep. Happy with those results. Okay. Continue on that. Now I'm just going to do... Okay. I'm just going to stay on there. Floor 42. I'll continue the next part of that um, in the next video. And what I am going to try to do is do my next Dark Dimension 4 attack. I can do it now on screen. But if it flops, then it's just silly. Um, but... Do you know what? I'll just do it for the sake of the video. If I don't do well, a good attack, I'll just show you what I do. So, full team, Dark Dimension 4. If I complete this based on this particular run, which is not po not impossible, just a little bit unlikely, I will get my three, third, uh, sorry, my third Dark Dimension 4 attack run win. And then if I do, then I got the max amount. So, what we got here, uh, the situation is Ultimus. But we're going to go straight in for big attacks. I'm just going to go for it. Oh god, that's De Deadpool. I just remembered, yeah. He made it quite tricky. I'm just going to have to stick to my guns now. Might regret it. But we're just going to have to go for the big attacks. Slow everyone down. Maybe not. Yeah, perfect. Okay. Okay, and then just keep going. I'm just going to get Ultimus first. Because he's quite annoying because he's quite strong. It feels like some characters are overpowered in the game uh, in certain modes. And Ultimus does seem to have a certain advantage in Dark Dimension. Which it's not strange, it's just a bit weird as well. Uh, yeah, Cable, we're just going to go for him. Because he's got less overall health and I'd rather attack him. Okay, at least this way we can get all the high attacks ready for the next wave. Okay, get the next heal going on. Go on again. And go for the middle one. And I'm just going to go for this one, Deadpool. And if he counters on Shocker, that's okay, because I'd rather lose Shocker than anyone else at this moment. So, Deadpool, hopefully the bleeds take on Cable enough. Perfect. We do need a slow on um, Deadpool. The only issue is the more negatives he has, the quicker he recovers because he's got more things to recover him. Okay. Okay. Next wave after this. Let's see what we're going to have. Save the big attacks for the next wave. Okay. Who have we got? Who's the issues? Oh, they're all issues. Okay. So it's going to be Black Widow. Whatever the attack is, I'm just going to go with this run. Okay. Okay. Just go all Black Widow because she can speed the team up. Once she does that, just a little bit more annoying. Uh, you got a few issues on this team, on the opposition, but we can only do what we can. Okay, just get as many negatives as we can. Luckily, there's no Jessica Jones or anyone to clear the negatives. So that's good for me. Okay. Yes, we got Disrupt on um, Black Widow. She can't exactly speed the team up, as in herself as well. We're going to get full, uh, Wanda, um, sorry, Scarlet Witch. Okay, Shield Operative, we have to get her. We're going to do that first. Because she can just heal the team. We're going to go for Vision in that side. Get the rest on this outside. Go to Scarlet Witch. She's actually one of my favourite characters. Like Just generally in the MCU, it's just, she's just really good. The fact that she can take on Thanos pretty much one-on-one. -on -one. Yeah, really good. And my respect for her in Wanda Vision just... It's still going up. Thanos with the taunt. Okay, doing surprisingly well so far. Um, just gonna keep attacking. And unfortunately with uh, Scarlet Witch, she's gonna equal the team out, but at least, um, at least she can actually, um, it's, it's still bringing the whole team's HP down. Okay. I'm just going to just do this attack, middle one. Survive just a little bit longer. Hopefully I can do some bigger attacks. 
Scarlet Witch, perfect out the way. Big attack on Vision. Okay. Come on, survive just. Come on. Okay, I'm hoping I can survive. I don't think it's going to happen. Not for. Yeah, okay, she can't do a big attack, unfortunately. That's not too bad of a run. Okay, just get one more attack in, and I'll be happy. By the way, I'm not going to use the big attacks, just going to use a small one. And then they're just going to keep smashing me up, and that, that should be fine. Not the best of results, but it's still good. Yep, that's it. So that's the kind of attacks I'm doing. I could have done better, but I'm doing on videos. So I'm just doing it in one smooth motion. So yeah, I'm just going to finish this video on that. But as you can see, now mission 15 on Dark Dimension 4. Again, I'm doing this for myself. Um, I'm on my sixth attack, the one that we just done. And it kind of indicates I'm towards the end, as you can see on the blue bar there. So yeah, that's pretty much it. And yep, yeah, I'll leave it at that for now. Thank you for watching. Please like my videos. Please share my videos. And please, yes, just write your comments below on what you'd like me to cover in the future. And please subscribe to my channel. Help me make the channel grow. And thank you for watching. Over and out. Oh, yeah.